Whether it was the tornadoes in April, the storm in June, or the windstorm just last week, our neighborhoods have lost a lot of trees the last few months. I'm Molly Hudson, outside of our station here at 108th and Mockingbird. While the focus is still very much on the cleanup, Nebraska Extension says when it is time to replant, there's opportunity in the loss we've seen. You can literally see other branches falling simultaneously in the area. Big old silver maple. Of storms snapping branches it was like crack and uprooting trees across Omaha. The golf course had uh, 200 trees that were removed since last Wednesday. According to the city of Omaha, the tornadoes on April 26th, the storms on June 25th, and last week's historic windstorm destroyed or damaged more than 2,700 trees. The vast majority, 2,200 and counting, are from last week's windstorm alone. We're really seeing what we would have expected. John Fesh, an educator at the Nebraska Extension, says the sturdy trees held up pretty well, and the fast-growing disease-prone trees did not. It means a loss of a lot of the benefits that trees bring, the shade value, the screening, uh, the habitat value. We have also lost some of the species that don't perform super well in our area. But Fesh says the loss gives homeowners options. Gives us an opportunity to increase diversity in the landscape and plant trees that are underplanted now, and also to plant trees that have a little bit more in the way of offering. And despite the devastation, another silver lining. Uh, fall is a great time to plant a tree. It's a matter, for, from our standpoint, of right plant, right place. Thinking about how big and how large and what shape the tree will become and what purpose does it serve. If you have a tree that was damaged or maybe you're concerned about the structural integrity of the tree, Fesh says to reach out to the International Society of Arboriculture or the Nebraska Arborist Association. In Omaha, I'm Molly Hudson, your neighborhood reporter.